for all mankind's dreams about reaching new worlds. We had always been tied to the one that created us. The signal changed all that. Sent from an uncharted part of the galaxy, it told us how to escape the confines of our world. So we followed its instructions and built vast seed ships that we sent across the galaxy to populate new worlds and search for the origin of the signal. Decades passed, and the more worlds we colonized, the more fractured we became. The new worlds wanted independence, but Earth wouldn't allow it. Then the colonists found the source of the signal, and everything changed again. They traced the transmission to the crash site of what was believed to be an escape pod. There was no evidence of a crew, just wreckage. But there was new technology there, and the colonies used it to strike a deal. Earth could study the wreckage in return for colonial independence. However, the deal turned sour. Earth scientists discovered something valuable at the site, something they wouldn't share. Afraid of what they might have found, the colonies expelled the Earth team. In response, Earth revoked their right to self-rule. War was inevitable. A war fought over those vast distances is expensive. Neither side could maintain the struggle for long. But nor could they back down. The war had to end. But we could not have predicted how far they would go to end it. What's going on you guys, Zo84 here from ZTK Gaming and today I've got a new game from Steam since we finished it with Fairy Bin Freesia, Strike Suit Zero. And once I'm done with this I've also got Strike Suit Infinity because I got a bundle of them both together. I got it about a month ago when it was on sale, I can't remember how much it was but it was somewhere under £10 and I got both games along with DLC. Uh, got artwork and soundtrack as well. So, the uh, main reason I got this game was it reminded me a bit of Armored Core, at least from what I remember. But, uh, I don't know too much about how it works, so let's just get straight in game and see what it's like. Alright, uh, this is just me testing it quickly. Nope. Once again I'm using a gamepad to play this. I recently bought a new gamepad, basically an Xbox controller, but for the PC. So it should be better than what I had before. Adams, you are required to undergo a flight assessment before you can return to duty. Flight team leader Reynolds will take you through your evaluation. It's my job to decide whether the UN well, looks like our name's Adams. Yeah. Don't give me a reason to fail you. Sure, this won't be too hard. We'll start slow with the freighter inspection at the loading platform. I'm uploading a navigation waypoint to your ship now. 
Okay. Oops. I'll do that. LT. I'm not too used to an Xbox controller, really. Uh, I played like Xbox like once or twice with my cousins. I have a PS3 at home, which is what I'm used to. I'm starting to get used to this controller. Sensors run their scan. This is the UNE freighter Proteus. She's shipping out to supply a massive deep space operation. Okay, Proteus, scan looks green. You're cleared for departure. Copy that. Moving into full position. Let's stay close and see her off. You crap. That wasn't going to happen. Uh, all right. Fancy. If only our civilization was as advanced. Next, we need to fold out to the weapons range. I'm uploading the location of the fold point to you now. Since you're under evaluation, I want to see if you can get there before I do. Race? Oh, but... Left foot down. Okay, that'll do. Locking in coordinates so where is it? Range. If we can do that, why couldn't that big ship do that? Where yeah. is everyone? This place is normally packed. Looks like there was a war here. What's left of the UNE frigate Pandora. We've been using her as target practice. The debris is pretty unstable. It won't take much to detonate what's left. Let's see you take that wreckage apart. Oh, right. Back is select, basically. Plasma cannon. Okay, um, X. Why are you doing anything to it? Not really good. Once again, it's a bit like Fairy Bloom Freesia. Not sure if I should talk or not. 
or play. Or if it'll be better if I just leave it. We detected some unauthorized fold signatures in your area. Oh boy. We've got a visual command. Three targets, colonial interceptors. Confirmed. Destroy targets and return to base. Command? Command. Okay, Adams. Weapons free. Take them out. I think it'll probably be better if I just stay quiet for this recording. So I'll just turn off the mic and I'll see you guys later. I don't know how long I'll play for, but we'll see.
This far in, they must have transferred the entire fleet to the front. Whatever the plan is, it's a big risk leaving us open like this. Fold engines recharged, let's get back to the station.
secured. And command. As far as I'm concerned, you can reinstate Adams. He passed. Copy that, Reynolds. In which case, you both have orders. You've been transferred forward. You're to rendezvous with the rest of the 407th, and then relay to these coordinates. You'll join the Earth Fleet operations, and we'll receive your orders there. Transferred forward? But you need all the help you can get back here. I appreciate that, Reynolds, but you have your orders. Copy that. Okay, Adams, we get to find out firsthand what the hell is happening out there. Right you guys, I'm back. What I've learned from mission one, I'm really bad at aiming. Uh, I'm not too used to playing shooting games with uh, gamepads, so I think I'll try using a mouse next time, but for this initial recording, uh, we'll just leave it like that. Uh, let me know what you think about this game in the comments below. So far, I think it's quite a good game, but <laughs> I'm not necessarily good at it. But I guess a bit more training wouldn't hurt. Uh, yeah, there's this DLC as well. I'll probably go through that once I've done with the campaign. And then after that, I'll move on to Strike Suit Infinity and any other things I can get my hands on from Steam. So uh, it's a new year now, so hope you guys have a good new year up ahead for you, 2014. Hopefully, it'll be better than 2013 for me. I don't know about you guys. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it from me. So, this is Zoe Eddie Four here from ZTK Gaming signing out. I see you guys next time. Bye.